All right. So we're here. Uh, I was trying to get the dummy in here, but I wasn't able to. So I'm just going to show. I'm just here real quick because I didn't cover this. The importance of why 35 is such a big deal. Um, like actually visually to show you. First off, Umbral Soul, new, new up, up. Great. It was like at 70, I think 6 before, so the fact that it's 35 and it does what it does is insanely good. Uh, but let's just do simple, like, so you have, uh, you have Fire One, right? It gives you one little orb. It's gonna hurt. Yeah, it's not gonna work out very well. Yeah, ow. God damn it. Okay, hold on. Uh, I was trying to do explorer mode so that I could show you, but it, it locks, it overrides it, so here, let me get out. I'll just show you normally. Pay no attention to whatever else happens to the bar. Just pay attention to the, <laughs> I guess, what what is happening around your character, right? So, um, here, I'll bring up the original gauge, because most people don't use simple mode. Um, uh, hold on. Sure. That's not what I want. Um, there we go. Okay. So we got the big thing, right? Uh, don't worry about this. Don't worry about this yet. Um, especially if you're following along at the level that I'm at. We're at, we're at 51 right now. We're at 53, actually. Um, so, you do one fire. You get the one. Right? You get another one. You get two. Yay. And then... Third one, you get a third one. Right? Okay, cool. If you, if you do a blizzard, it goes bye-bye. Right, gone. But if you do Blizzard 5, and then you do Blizzard 3 specifically, not only will you cast it at, ha at like really fast, instead of it being, I think, 2.44, it's 158, so it's incredibly fast. Right, here we go. Uh, 316. Look at how fast, look at how long that would take. Instead, you just cast the Fire 4, which is the same thing, but because you were at three stacks, oh, it only works at three, um, you can do Blizzard at very high speed, but it also actually gives you all three. Whereas if you do Fire 3, and then, oh, wait, I'm going to have Parallax. Pay no attention to that, but that thing is about to happen. Yeah, that. Um, if I go Blizzard 1, cast it really fast, but it's gone. You don't want to do that. Um, so, that's why it's important, right? What also is important is that once you achieve the ability to use these two, these now also, uh, which would be, these are the same buttons as Fire 2 and uh, Blizzard 2, these also have that same property now. So whenever you cast a Fire 2, Boom, all three. Blizzard two, boom, all three. Fire two, Blizzard two, Fire two, Blizzard two. Uh, fire five, Fire three, and Fire one. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. that that's just the same button as Fire. And then, oh no, I ran out of MP. Okay, cool. Cast uh. All right, there you go. And then I have this. All right, so. Fire three, blizzard three. Fire three, blizzard three. Fire three, blizzard three. Fire three, blizzard three. I'm just, this is just a show. This is not something you really want to do. Um, I'm, it's just important to show that, uh, same thing if you did blizzard and for whatever reason you cast a fire, it would cast, uh, it would cast really, really fast, but gone. It kills your entire thing. That's all I wanted to show. That's That happens at 35 of them. 35. 
Yeah, 35 is where you get your third charge, and it reads, allows the stacking of a third Astral Fire and Umbral Ice. Casting Fire 2 or Blizzard 2 grants maximum stacks of Astral Fire or, Fire or Umbral Ice, respectively. While under the effect of Astral Fire 3, the potency of Fire Spells is increased by 80%, and the cast time of Ice Spells is halved, and the potency lowered by 30 while under the effect of Umbral Ice 3, 10,000 MP is recovered upon landing an Ice Spell, any Ice Spell. Uh, and the cast time of Fire Spells is halved and the potency lowered by 30. So now comes in the part where you get Fire Starters, right? I think you get Fire Starters earlier, actually. Yeah, 35. So... Yeah, Fire Starters at 42, right? So at 42, you get the ability to proc a Fire Starter. This is just a quick little thing. Um, let's proc a fire starter. Fire starter. We're waiting to proc it. Right. It's very situational. This this thing I'm about to show. Uh, it's very very situational. Okay, we got a fire starter, right? So, say you have a fire starter, and it was the last bit of MP you had, and then boom, you're casting, and then you you cast your ice spell to get your 10k MP back. Since you have a fire starter, it's better to not lose that 30% potency. It's better to transpose into a fire three. That way, you get the damage, the more damage. I think I think I mentioned it in one of the videos, but I didn't actually do. It. I think I did it once. Um, not, it's not super, super important, but it's just nice for extra damage. So, that's all I wanted to show. I will be putting this under the uh, Sunken Temple of Karn video. Actually, at, after the Sunken Temple of Karn video. Um, even though it's later in uh, in the progress of... We were we are at this dungeon right now. Don't mind. Don't mind all that. Ooh, all that. I was trying to do something. But it didn't work. Um, we are at... Nope. Heaven Sword. We are now at Somal. So we finished Lux Vigil yesterday. And we're at Somal. So we're at 53. And I'm gonna... And I just needed to clear this part up. Um, trying to think of anything else before I leave. Uh, oh, Umbral Soul. The thing that, that drove me nuts uh, the other day was... If I do a Blizzard 1... And I'm in combat. And I cast... Umbral Soul, well, it only gave me two. But if I'm. Oops, I'll just break it real quick. Okay. And I cast. No, no. Uh, actually, wait. I have to. <laughs> I'm done. Hold on. There you go. And I'm at a combat, and I only have one. Boom. All three. That's how it was happening. It was driving me nuts how it was happening, because I did not know. But it's just that. Um, so yeah, that's it. That's what we will keep doing for now. Um, and yeah, hopefully that was that was more helpful in understanding why why thirty five is such an important level because it's when you get really like you get a flow to you. So like, boom, you're over here. And you do, don't don't mind that. You want to do this? Do that switch over oh and I guess another one that I'm kind of working on another little technique that works is I, I mentioned it but I never actually did it uh it's like okay cool you're in this phase and you need you need to cast but you can't uh hold on uh you need to cast but you can't because you keep getting interrupted at this point just hit that get your 10 get your 10k back and just go right back into it Yeah, hit Umbral Soul, and then just go right back into it. Um, so yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Also, don't forget your mana fonts. Those are fun. Whee! So. That is it. I will see you guys in the next video. Tomorrow. I'm I'm going to sleep. <laughs> Y'all have a good night. Take care. I'll see you later.